my room 18. Um, I have another book for us today. This book is called Pete the Cat and His Magic Sunglasses. This is my favorite Pete the Cat book and I hope you guys enjoy it too. Let's read. The author's names are Kimberly and James Dean. Remember, the authors are the ones that write the words. Now guess what? It doesn't have some illustrators listed, so I guess that means that they are also the illustrators, so they also drew the pictures. How cool, right? So talented. Okay, let's enjoy. Pete did not feel happy. Pete had never, ever, ever, ever been grumpy before. Pete had the blue cat blues. How's he feeling? Show me with your face. Then, as if things were not bad enough, along came Grumpy Toad. Grumpy Toad was never happy. He always had a frown. Look at him being grumpy. But wait, maybe he's not that grumpy. But Grumpy Toad was not grumpy today. He said, these cool blue magic sunglasses make the blues go away. They're magic? They make you stop feeling sad? That's pretty cool. They help you see things in a whole new way. Pete put on the glasses. I'm going to put my glasses on too. Pete put on the glasses and he looked all around. Right on, he said. The birds are singing, the sky is bright, the sun is shining. I'm feeling all right. The sunglasses helped him. They made him stop being sad and scared. He felt happy now. Pete thanked Grumpy Toad for the cool magic sunglasses. He went on his way. As soon as he saw Squirrel, Squirrel did not look happy, Pete said. What's wrong, Squirrel? I'm so mad. Nothing is going my way. I only found one acorn today. Hm. How does Squirrel feel? He said, it said he's mad because he can only find one acorn. Oh, poor Squirrel. I hope that he can use the magic sunglasses too. Pete said, try these cool blue magic sunglasses. They help you see things in a whole new way. Ooh, maybe he's gonna try them on. Squirrel put on the cool blue magic sunglasses and looked all around. Awesome. The birds are singing, the sky is bright, the sun is shining, and I'm feeling all right. Oh, he's happy because of sunglasses. He's seeing everything good around him. Pete said goodbye to Squirrel and continued his way. Soon he saw his friend, Turtle. Turtle did not look happy. What's wrong, Turtle? Pete asked. I'm so frustrated. Nothing is going my way. I'm all upside down today. He's frustrated. Frustrated means he's kind of mad and he can't fix this thing that he needs to fix. He's upset. Pete said, try these cool blue magic sunglasses. They help you see things in a whole new way. Hmm. I hope they work for him too. Okay, let's put them on. Put on your sunglasses. Turtle put on the cool blue magic sunglasses and looked all around. Far out! The birds are singing, the sky is bright, the sun is shining, and I'm feeling all right. He's happy too. These are awesome sunglasses. I should wear them all the time. Pete kept rolling along until he saw Alligator. Alligator did not look happy. What's wrong, Alligator? Pete asked. I'm so sad. Nothing is going my way. No one wants to play with me today. He's sad. No one wants to play with him. Show me sad. Pete said, try these cool blue magic sunglasses. They help you see things in a whole new way. Let's see if he, what works. <gasps> Alligator put on the cool blue magic sunglasses and looked all around. Rockin'. 
The birds are singing, the sky is bright, the sun is shining, and I'm feeling all right. Pete was rolling along, feeling all right, when suddenly he fell back. <gasps> he fell. Oh no, what happened? The cool blue magic sunglasses went crack. Uh-oh, Pete didn't know what to do without the sunglasses. They're broken. <gasps> but they were magic, they made everything better. What's he gonna do now? What do you think? Hmm. Let's find out. I hope that he can still have a good day. Just then, Pete looked up at the tree. Wise old owl said, Pete, you don't need magic sunglasses to see things in a new way. Just remember to look for the good in every day. I'm going to read that again. Look for the good in every day. Find things that are good. Find the sun. You don't need sunglasses to see that the sun's shining or that the sky is bright. You don't need to see all those things with magic sunglasses. You can just look around and find things that make you happy in your life. Pete looked around without his sunglasses. Too cool. The birds are singing. The sky is bright. The sun is shining. And we are feeling all right. Look. They don't have their sunglasses on and they're still feeling happy. That's pretty cool. So Pete learned that even though the sunglasses were magic, he doesn't need those magic glasses. If he just finds the good in each part of his day, he can have a happy day, right? So I hope you can find things that make you happy today and talk about them with your family, okay? I hope you enjoyed this awesome book and I will see you guys soon. Bye.